hello guys welcome to my new tutorial in this tutorial we're gonna learn how to work with action script action script and uh, we'll work with the button so guys this is the most favorite part of mine in flash this is great to work with so let's get started guys even though you don't have previous background of programming but uh, you can work with action script it's so damn easy so let's get started and let's see how does it work so here guys let's set, let's start let's start here i will import something i i oops i got a gift for you here it is on my desktop here truck here's a gift for you guys today we will move this gift and this truck with action scripting we will create buttons those button will 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 control the truck so for that we need to amend we need to make some changing oops i can't just press ctrl d select it and ctrl d ctrl d gonna make it break apart so that we can we can edit the picture yeah guys here just make a zoom and start your razor tool I will skip the razor part because it's taking time so no need to make you bother so guys I'll skip it So here guys we did already we removed the unwanted part of the truck so here it is see it's all done so what i am going to do wait a minute oh, here i will change the name of the layer make it truck because uh, later on we will understand this is our truck on this layer and the new layer is road we will draw a road on the on the screen guys here i just make it thicker Oops, I select the truck, just select the line tool and just select the draw a line first better. Here it is, see. It's already did. So just I will make it a bit bigger. Oh, 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 oh. Here it is guys, just bring it in the middle of the stage here i will bring one more line yep bring it down yeah is it a road looks like a road no i guess no still we need to work on let me bring the lines parallel to each other here it is oops it's so narrow right and now i think only the issue is truck behind the road so bring the truck up no it's okay guys just save it before it gonna hey guys here it is just move the truck here oops there is the outline guys uh -oh, we need to delete that outline it's gonna make us trouble so how do we delete that first bring the truck far make it hide and block now we can easily delete, delete it and unhide the road again and break the truck back on its place here it is so now guys we need one more layer for our buttons so we will add here one more layer and we will draw here button so we don't have button for now so what we'll do we have learned already how to create a button so start button here it is it's so damn simple you have ever already learned in previous in previous uh, video 
so guys i will skip it make it bit faster So here now guys our button is ready is functional but nothing behind the button yet I mean no action script yet on the button so what we are going to do now we will give a motion twin to the truck just let it move just let's see how does it work F5 to add keyframe add frame only here F6 I will add here one more keyframe here create motion twin here last frame and moves out of the screen F5 here so that we can see the road and F5 here so that we can see the button so guys here it is it's just a simple animation yeah but what we need I want when I press the start button then it should move now it's showing it's, it's, it's just moving by its own so what I need to do first I need to stop the truck moving it's moving by his own so for that I will add one more layer here guys action script so the good practice is that we need to add one more layer only for action script so guys just choose the first frame and it's so simple just write stop an English word we do with two braces and uh, here guys see there's a small 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 dot that's showing what action script oops it's a bit far up see here is showing something new on the on the layer that's mean there is an action script on the layer so guys see the truck is not moving now because once the movie start the stop command does work so truck will not move anymore so one step is done now what we need to do we will select our button and then we will add scripting here what we need to do when we press the button so I write here on braces press on press when I press the button so what's happen what happened when I press the button I want go to and stop go to and stop where on the frame number 10 yeah truck on the frame number 10 so I will write here just simply 10 here that's it so damn simple guys it's, it's, it's a English only here it is just close the bracket that's it this is all our coding this is so damn simple so just hit control and enter and let's check by default it's stop because oops oh, oh guys because I pray I I use the action script here what well, go to and stop is it uh, supposed to be go to and play sorry guys sorry for mistake but we are learning together here go to and make it play because if go to and stop it will go to the tenth frame and it will stop the movie will not work so now see Ta-da! yeah <laughs> it's working looks nice when I press here it is guys yeah 
that's all keep pressing 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 yeah guys in the same way what I will do I will create another button and I will name the button reverse okay so the logic is exactly the same what will happen now what we are doing we press start button and uh, and our um, uh, superior track is working forward then we will add another button the superior track <laughs> will work backward so we will make here reverse button here guys same way how to create a button and same everything will be same oops just change the color i use white color so it's merged with the with the background here it is so guys i will make the video tour i mean faster so you can see everything what's going on uh, so you will create a reverse button that's it guy So see guys what's going on here I will make another animation create motion twin here where the truck will reverse bring it here put it here like this see in this animation on next frame click the button and make the same again go to and play and uh, 51 is the frame number and here we go forward oops but it's working backward also without pressing the button so guys we need to add here one more frame press F7 to enter a keyframe empty keyframe and put here stop yep same way so when the truck will go other side I mean forward it will go out of the screen and the movie will stop when we will press reverse button then the truck will come back so here it is we can bring the truck bit here guys no need to bring it in out of the screen yep I want it like this so that's all guys for today so do not forget to subscribe our channel press the bell icon so that you will get updated by our next videos take care of yourself guys see you soon bye bye i'm oh, sorry i forgot to tell you take care of my truck also thank you guys bye bye